the intro, yeah? Slow, 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 slow. Viewers, yes. listeners, we are back again for what you know, part five. Part five, episode five. Episode five. Yeah, I just know people don't know say the difference between part five and episode five. I don't even understand. You are talking about somebody who did illicit English. Forget. And you are telling part five. When we say part five, it means we are doing series. So we break <laughs> we break them into parts. Yes, this is your main man, Kim Fredericks, and I have my co-host sitting by me. Kobno Foriabwa, CEO of Foritech. Obvious, as you know. Today is what do you know episode five. Yes, episode Today's five. Topic. Yes. But I, I I I dropped the bombshell off camera. I said yeah. viewers, listeners, breaking news. <laughs> Elon Musk has been overthrown <laughs> last year as the richest man. Now he's owned by Arnold, the Due owner of investment. Exactly, the owner of Louis Vuitton. We'll talk more about it either on this what you know or the time with the CEO. CEO. So, so you stay will tuned. You'll find more about investment. It's about investment so that we don't do Sweet. bad investment and lose cash. <laughs> okay, now we're talking about McMill and Shatawali's uh. trending issues. Everybody knows what is McMill. So um, we'll be speaking. Is it McMill or Millimill? No, McMill. McMill. Okay. okay. So yeah, McMill is apparently is is an American rapper. He's an American rapper who visited Ghana, and he's still a, a, a rapper. He's a rapper. He's, he's got Ghana. he's got trending songs. Okay. And visited Ghana, and on his arrival, and stay in Ghana, he went to visit um, our highly highly sophisticated uh, Flagstar house where the president is housed uh, housed visitors at the same time stays there yeah. and then did some uh, unpardonable mistakes. When we say unpardonable, it's a mistake where no no, can, no country you. can allow Nobody no one or anyone to do that in his uh, highest house. We have guys who rose with the big boys in America. That's correct. Like uh, Nana Kwame Bidiak, who rose with what? Yeah, who rose with Money Mayweather. Yeah. So you should accord the country with respect, but notwithstanding the fact that Ghana, listen, who orchestrated this move where he had to liaise between that boy and Jubilee House? You don't say be ex convicts, have you? Of course. Ex-convict. Now, Ghana, who in the, in, even in South Africa, who is ex-convict? And yes, you know, I'm a As I was doing, who is a correctional service? The pressure is down, so you get my point. Two, who was the mediator between Flagstar House or Jubilee House, Jubilee House. and the corner of McMill? Because I don't even know whether he owns a platform for people to even address him. No, people know they talk about him. If Americans have like that. Yes. Three. Three. What was his motive for going to Jubilee House? Yeah. The president we, invited him. Yes. If all rappers, underground rappers or rappers who sing 10 songs and eight it's, is a hit, goes to, goes to Ghana and go and see president, then the country is at security response. I, I say, say, you have some nice views, viewers. We still go Ghana and go see. Of course, because I'm also famous. Yes, for yes. eating a, a fufuni upon chicken crab. <laughs> you get my point. Okay, just by the way, viewers, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't post the disclaimer. Every views and objective is not coming from Foritech Online TV or mm. Foritech IT Solution, but it's coming from we the panelists. Yeah, and also we we urge you to subscribe, like. And comment and press the notification button, yes, so that you can get all and, the latest. And news. this is brought to you by what Foritech IT Solution, the yeah. mother company of Foritech Online Television, Sweet. where we provide basic coral draw designs, Some card printing, bam. UV printing, bam. and stuff like that. Check yeah. below the screen, take our numbers, hit hit the bottom, hit the telephone numbers when you need your coral draw designs. Yeah, is, why, why are you the slayer now? Like, Oh, someone said, "Who this salad?" The slang comes, but like I said, I have a guy who is producing me. His name is Michael Koyasa. Oh dear, money, shit up. That's why you shit. Such boys cannot slang because they they eat this. Yeah, but December he was slang. No, so that's kind of want to know a picture, picture, and a bet. This guy, this guy is S I, you know, S I F O. Nesajo, I've heard here. What's your overall? 
We are painting our door. Guys, it's just by the way, we are trying to make the program interesting. But it's a sad news. Ghanaians needs to... to Really wake up on this. I'm telling you. So now listen, this is my take on it. One, Mick Mill needs to apologize to Ghanaians. Mm -hmm. Two, the office of the president heads must roll, people must lose their job. Yeah. And there must be a what? A breaking letter news addressed to all citizens of Ghana, both far and wide. This Apology. Two days ago. Uh, two days, two or three days ago. Jeez, man. So I don't want to detect for the president because I love our president. He's our is our is the first citizen in Ghana. But I think uh, Mr. President, I don't want them to use your office as a cartoon. I seriously. You know? Because let me tell you guys something. When I went to the state, to even see White House, there's a, a boundary. From New York, I was able, I say from New York, I was able to move from Virginia. Virginia. I went to World Trade Center, and I went to Washington. Washington. You could see that place. The mere fact that you see that building, White yeah. House, it commands respect. Yeah. So they wouldn't allow any refraff. I'm not saying Big Mill is a refraff. To us, I can call him a reference because he has this like desecrated, really he has desecrated the highest building in our country. So the people in Ghana need apology from the, the Jubilee House, and Mick Mill needs apology. Like I said to you off camera, that my supervisor, when I was doing my national service in Accra Metro Road Department, said the strength of a bridge depends on how many people work on it every day. Yeah, it's the same way. If you want to be accorded with respect, your respect will now determine on how the apology rendered to Ghana. Otherwise, every country will emulate what you are going to do to you. They will not allow you to even set foot and be given chance to see the highest people on the land. That's true. Do the right thing, my nigga, and we will forgive you with, uh, with the Jubilee House. Please, and we quote, we shouldn't wash our dirty linen outside. You know, the whole world is laughing at us. Now. You know what? Um, one and, thing, too, that and, I, can, I can add up to this is um, I'll, in some point, I don't really blame Mick Mill. Okay. It's a Millie Mill or whatever. Because definitely there is someone who said, oh, you can go on. You can no, do it. No, that's what I'm saying. Can I tell you guys a secret? And they can even come for me. I'm waiting for them. I'm saying, hey, <laughs> Street. <laughs> now, listen, Ghana, everything is money. Somebody took money, money exchanges, and they, they saw somebody who is closer to somebody and somebody and somebody. <laughs> but let me tell you guys something. The rest of Africa calls Ghana as a joke. Seriously. You can't do that. Let me tell you guys that you, country. You, you don't understand. You see America as everything. But I want you to learn this thing from me. Do you know why Americans do this a lot? Do you know why? Why? Today I'm going to tell you. America is powerful and mighty because of the people who live inside. Yeah. So every year they want more people who are talented and educated to come and gain citizenship for the country to become powerful. Mm -hmm. So I want viewers and listeners to understand that America belongs to everyone and everyone that stays in it. in it. You get my point. So please, let us understand that we need to respect our country in general. Now, um, before I, I give you a chance to talk, Shatawala came to tweet about... The Nova tweets. Uh, non city in, in school, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Papa, papa. And I want to tell my 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 best friend that <laughs> shut up this one here, wow, Charlie. Wow, you don't wow. flop too much because too much. one, you always fight Nigerians for disrespecting Ghanaians, yeah. but now you're asking somebody to disrespect Ghana because he's an American. So your tweet, maybe let me just put it this way. But the Shatawa, no, Shatawale, Shatawale didn't even know what is going on because some of the tweets does not make sense to me. It was a non fact. Yeah, I get my point. So, Shata, um, you know I'm always your man. I love you so much. Go go back, watch the video from 
except for extract from your, your, your friends or anybody who's got a video in your closet, and then come and read to it again. Because you, the same person, fought with... Um, a German artist? Yes, you fought with uh, uh, Whiskey, yes. Brenner Boy, and some Nigerian artists that they do disrespect Ghana. Now, what about somebody who yeah, was, who went industry. to the highest house of the of the land, went to sing profanity, wear undesirable clothes in our state house? Yeah. Now, you, I know where you are coming from, Shata. You are saying we should blame the Jubilee House. No. No, Shata didn't even say that. Do you know what Shata is? Saying? <laughs> when Shata was even invited to Jubilee House, if you see the dressing code, you you marvel. Formal, like shut up. Yeah, because that's the highest land. You highest, understand? Highest he, he house of the land. respect that day. On his first tweet, you know, they talk, say, uh, so you Ghanaians, if you had seen the Milo and the sugar and the milk that these guys did for me, then you will say that me too, they gave me all the things that was in the house. Can you compare your Milo or the, the hospitality service that you got on that day to what McMill did? on that specific day. And also, Shata, I want to uh, uh, advise him. He must stop um, saying people must must look for money. Shata, it's not everybody who's got money who come and show up. Yeah. People are fucking rich. People are making it like the way you think you are making it. Because Shata, the amount that you're worth is me measured by yourself. And his swimming pool. And your swimming pool. <laughs> the amount that I... Because I've also, I've also got the swimming pool. Ah, obvious. But how many swimming pools are in uh, Essie? Almost in every house. house. In my house, in my... Uh, where I'm staying now, I've got a swimming pool. A, f a floating one. There but is, uh, there, was, there is one house I'm managing in Sunny Hill. I closed the pool because I don't need it. Yes. I closed it. What is pool? Pool. Because uh, it's, it's, it's just... You dig and you cement, you, you stylish it and put swim. water and put chlorine. Water so fish. When you do that, shut up. Um, people tend to call you naiveness because yeah. and you don't feed people. So I love you so much because if you check my last episode I did, yeah. you were always, you, I always give you thumbs up. I go with Kudu Shedding. Sounds same say no. We expect you to be outspoken and blast the guy yeah. and the people in Jubilee House, Correct. not to support Jubilee House, because they've they desecrated the land. And I think say, uh, I wouldn't have much to say, although I've said a, a mouthful. I'm sad. Ghana is a joke. Ghana indeed is a joke. But all said, McMill needs to apologize. The office of the president. So people people must lose their job. Technology alone can can really ease the heart of a lot of people. No, because no. right now, um, um, what is his name um, in America? What is what is the uh, brand of America? Did they attempt to bring? Jenny Jonas. Nah, I put your own movie video on the ground. We did the attempt from almost almost no, two hours. No, he's he's, he's really amazing. Then he's really later he said, "What your mom buy a movie video?" No, the was video is there. First, no, the point first, is, first he's amused because he stays in America. Yeah. He knows that America, you cannot. He said, no, no, there go area. Like no, that. no, go area. So, with further ado, this is my take. Shatawali's tweet to me wasn't known far, but does not really make sense. McMill needs to apologize, and the office of the president needs to come out. And really speak about yeah, it. Yeah, speak about it. Because okay. um, there are some MPs and some state high ground guys are really defending McMill's stuff, say, what he did, there's nothing wrong. Now if you cry in America, they even shoot movies. Hey, please, guys, there is nothing like that. You cannot shoot a movie in White House in America. No, it's not If funny. there is even an interview, they have a specific room, not in the Oval. Mm. Never. All those things that you guys you see, trust me, it's all fictions. 
Not even a studio built. They yeah. build these things in the studio. Guys, so please let's have knowledge about these things before we go on Twitter and tweet all these things. Let us not second this attitude, really uncalled for attitude that McNeil really did in Ghana. It doesn't make sense in any way. Let us not even think about it. Say that is the right way to do things. It's it, no man. Yeah. Like my co-host said, he has said a mouthful. I don't even have anything to say. I'm disappointed in the Ghanaians. I'm disappointed in Shatawale. But I said, next time you catch us on the break, we'll be presenting something lively uh, later in the day. I want you viewers to watch out. It's going to be a serious trending topic. But McMill, apologize. Jubilee House, come up with a, a, with a letter. And then I think Ghanaians are good to go. Chill. Catch you on the break. Yeah.